so let's do this. What is the purpose of subversive content exactly? I am now going to provide a huge spoiler for the film The Departed, so please skip to this point in the video if you've not seen it as it is fantastic. The Departed follows two characters that are mirrors of each other, a cop who doubles as a mole for a crime family he's a part of, and a crook who is actually an undercover police officer trying to bring the crime family down. The film ramps up its tension and stakes throughout until our undercover cop catches the mole and decides to bring him in. They have a conversation in an elevator and everything seems to work out just fine for our hero until the doors open and he's shot dead gone from the film. Why does this work? Why is this subversion well written? Because by killing our hero, the villain is now the main character, and we will follow him as he tries to fix his life and recover from all of these events until we reach the climax of the film. Stories don't tend to do this inherently as it is unwise to bind us to one character and then switch us over to someone else, but The Departed made sure to develop both characters before making this switch with plenty of room for an invested ending to the story. Star Wars The Last Jedi employs this same method of subversive storytelling, but it is always is so lackluster. Every choice that is made to surprise the audience is a letdown. It doesn't lead anywhere. There is nothing to think about, nothing to draw from. It is a definitive dead end. Of course, many will argue that that is something to think about. The fact that all of these theories are now gone. Isn't that fascinating? Well, I suppose I can't tell you what you're going to be interested by, but the answers are just so simple. It turns out Snoke is no one. It turns out Rey is no one. It turns out Luke hates the Jedi. It turns out Holdo was right all along. These subversions are often poorly written, but even those add something to the storyline. The ones that are well written, the dead end storylines, tend to just cut off what could have been fascinating lineages for characters. Rey could have had parents who weren't from the original trilogy, that could have made her story that much more endearing. Perhaps a bounty hunter called Yanis Fang, and he has his own interests in the galaxy, which could make for a conflict with his now daughter, where he needs to decide if he's going to get involved. The bounty hunter could offer her some insight to morality? Or how about a drunken miner on some distant moon who did indeed sell her on a different planet as a baby for money, and she was sold around but he now regrets his decision and has been searching for her only to get far more than he bargained for? The drunk could be the lesson about the folly of trying to identify through her parents. How about a high-ranking officer in the First Order that made a mistake and got rid of his child but now has to decide whether he will defect to protect her or at the very least perform covert levels of sabotage to save her life? This could help explain the incompetence of the First Order and provide scenes of conflicting ideology, even if it is a little bit too similar to Rogue One. You can make a whole new story or one that has nothing to do with the original films, but to do nothing, to cut things off, to shunt these stories down, to put in dead ends, it's just so casual and lazy. It means you have to do no characterization, no connections, no continuity, no world building around the characters. You don't actually have to do anything, in fact. All I can say is that I can do nothing but be disappointed in the writer. Next time, Ryan, please do anything. Something. So, as I said, what is the purpose of subversive content? To surprise your audience with a thread they didn't see coming, yet one that is equally as effective compared to what they expected, or perhaps even better. Rey, a completely blank slate, perfect in every way, was waiting for her parents to define her origins. And now, Rey, a completely blank slate, perfect in every way, has no origin of interest. Thank you for subverting my expectation.